Good morning, everyone. Welcome to our morning inspiration. Saturday, June 22, 2024. Our reading today comes to us from Romans chapter 8, verse 28. And it says, And we know that all things work together for good to them that love God, to them who are called according to His purpose. Amen. We give God thanks this morning again for a portion of his word. And this is to encourage somebody this morning. I don't know what it is that you may be going through. And maybe you feel like things just not working out the way you expected them to. And maybe you might be asking, where is God in all of this? You might be questioning your existence. You might be feeling overwhelmed. But I just want to encourage you this morning, according to the word of God, you are okay. The word of God reminds us this morning that nothing that happened to you or nothing that will happen to you will work for evil against you. Because God can turn every bad situation into a good one. We are reminded that all things work together for our good for those who are called according to God's purpose. So if you are called, if you understand that you are a part of his plan, then you will understand this morning that nothing happens by chance. God have a plan in place for your life and he will fulfill that purpose towards you in the appointed time. So cheer up. Don't be discouraged. It might seem a ways off. And you might be saying to yourself, I just don't have the strength to go any further. But I want to remind somebody this morning that, yes, you don't have the strength, but God has the strength. And so he has provided the strength for you. And all he's saying that just hold on. Just be patient. Don't give up. This seems like it's taking a long time. I have been waiting for my breakthrough for years, for months, for weeks. Now I'm at a point where I just don't know what next. Understand that you're at a good point. Why are you at a good point? Because now God has the opportunity to work on your behalf while you continue to trust Him. This is where your faith must be elevated to new heights this is where you must feel encouraged and empowered because the god who took care of you yesterday is about to do something marvelous for you don't look at what is happening around you don't become burdened and despondent rejoice rejoice because your king god your creator god your redeemer god is on your side and is about to act. Don't you worry about a thing. He is working on your behalf. In fact, he is in the process of delivering your deliverance. It's on the way and it is coming sooner than later. So don't you be discouraged, my friend. I know it's never easy when we have to endure these times of difficulties. But just as a gold or a piece of metal goes through the, the process of the purifying fire. So you too have to endure the fire so that God can shine in your life. So that he can bring you the deliverance that you so desire. But if you give up now, then you are going to miss out on your breakthrough. So if you are called, trust God. Know that God loves you. So what are the three things that I want you to take away from this reading this morning? One, all things will work for your good. Two, God loves you. And three, God has a purpose for your life. And he will fulfill that purpose in you. May God continue to richly bless you. And may he continue to give you the strength that you need to remain steadfast and to keep moving forward. May he fill your heart with joy and peace as you continue to wait on him. Soon he will 
deliver. Amen.